is starting to warm up and track season has just begun. It's only a matter of time before we start seeing runners on the road again. And now that they're back, there's a rising concern for student athlete safety on the streets. No, woo. We talked to Kikapu High School's sports administrator, Scott Phillips, to see if there's any reason for concern. We don't see, we don't hear very much very often at Kickapoo. Our cross country and track coaches, they are required to submit maps showing the routes that our runners will specifically be running. So high school athletes are on the road, but what rules do they follow and how are they implemented? We went to Kickapoo track coach, Jamie Goddard, to find out. Uh, we always run on the sidewalk when available. Uh, the only roads we don't are the roads that are neighborhood roads or back streets with not a lot of traffic. Every time we go out on the roads, I remind them to follow the road rules and, and I just stress the importance of what will happen if we don't. I've been coaching for 22 years and been at Kickapoo for uh, 19 of those and, and we've run every day uh, without having a major incident. We've heard from leadership, but we went to one of the runners to see how they avoid accidents on the road. So pretty much to prevent accidents on the road, you just gotta kind of stay aware of your surroundings and know like where cars are coming from. I think runners get kind of lazy sometimes and don't really look for cars because they think they see them. I mean, people don't really see runners as much and I think they think they'll get out of their way. So I think drivers need to be more a little more cautious of people on the road. So in reality, there is not any major concern as long as you pay attention to your surroundings. This is Jack Rayner for Kickapoo Chief TV.